you know, it's been a while since I've played this game, and to come back and find out that Azrael is only level 10, oh my god, we sure have our work cut out for us. So, welcome back, Tom Brussel. It's been 3,000 years. I'm not going to apologize for anything. I know I'm not consistent. So today we're going to Linnao. We need to go to that tower over there and blow up some stuff. So let's just get to it. Wow. What the hell is this? Alright, well, let's look around. Alright, what do we got? Hey, if you don't want to, why are you coming here? Information. So I said, hey, goblin, that's me wife! <laughs> Just how many times you're going to tell that same joke? Alright, there's no information in here. So that, look, I can drink as much as any man here. Oh, <laughs> Oh my gosh. Alright, well, there was no th information in the bar, unfortunately. So what's up with it? Using magic crystals overgrown lanterns. What a waste. <laughs> Alright, well, let's look around some. Oh. And cool, five minutes for serving. There, she's about done. Oh, excuse me, my family and I were just about to have dessert. So I'm afraid there won't be enough to go around. My kids inhale desserts like they go, like they're nothing. <laughs> well, it's a shame. Alright. Real shame this town's gonna be obliterated soon. You feel it? There's magic in the air. Let me get a place like this makes you feel truly alive. I'll see if I can't fix that for you. <laughs> Alright, what else do we got? Um, oh, hi. I'm sure you're wondering why it is. Okay. See, we have a child away. He's, he's sparing me from as many physical tasks possible. Please, we meal is me able to marry such a kind hard man. Wait, can I, okay, we can go upstairs. Not that there's anything up here. Alright, let's see. There are a lot of houses here that I want to look at. Excuse me, I have a class teacher for 30 minutes. I must review this material. Your presence is interfering with my concentration. Furthermore, what are you doing in my house? <laughs> uh, uh, what the hell? Uh oh. What's this? This door is actually locked? Seems like one person in this town has a bit of common sense. Do you know that magic can help accelerate the growth of crops? Magic certainly is amazing, isn't it? More than you know. Alright. That's not like that one house in the last episode. Where the lady locked the door after we left. What is this? Oh, are you new to town? Bet you never seen a magic circle before, huh? That's a bet you'd lose. Just step by and whoosh, you'll be on the other side of the flash. Only a fool with the intellect of a slime wouldn't know something like that, you incompetent. I mean, I didn't know that. Thank you very much. Sh sure. <laughs> Alright, we have an item shop. We don't need to go to the weapon shop because we can't get new weapons. But... It's just the same old crap we've been picking up. We haven't been able to fight any encounters in a while. So we haven't been able to get any more money. But... Okay, we have the inn. We have this place. Okay, whoa. Oh, it's a library. The best spell used against a slime would be... Is it Fireball? An entrance exam, huh? My goodness, ancient times were filled with such violence and bloodshed. I'm glad we don't live in a world like that anymore. Um, yeah, about that. You are joking, aren't you? 
Really, this is the best way to get some shy. So that the switch is Doxy on second. <laughs> oh, okay. It does seem like the NPCs don't have anything useful for us, just generally. I think Trails has spoiled me on NPC dialogue, unfortunately. Uh, Demon, is that you? What? Sister Claire? Having fun with your new friends, are you? I hope you're not getting yourself in any tree trouble. Me? Trouble? As if. <laughs> so, uh, what are you doing here? I thought I'd change the scenery, but I uh, besides, these people seem to need to know that Lumio is still watching over them, even if we cannot see or hear her. That's a comfort. There's a comforting thought. Oh, I had almost forgotten. There was someone who came by the church who was asking for you, Damien. Seems he had an urgent matter to discuss with you. Someone's looking for me? This guy didn't have to be covered in armor and have a big pointy weapon, did he? Oh, Damien, you did always have such a unique sense of humor. Wait, what? Someone's hunting you? There was something about that man, however. Something that felt off. Truth be told, he frightened me, so I used this trip as an excuse to get away from him. Please, Damien, if you're going to have to deal with that man, be careful. I can sense something dangerous about him. Don't you worry about me, sister. I can handle myself. The mysterious vi- Okay, well, this is uh, Hold on. Shit. I just realized, if I want- Never mind, I can do this. Let me see here. Should this individual produce some mayor of hero, be wise to cut them down before they become a threat. Head to Riding Cathedral and discover their identity. Well, I mean, we can do that later. So, is this the place? Ah, this must be the portal to the floating school. Come, you two. We're going to be late for class. Um. <laughs> What's wrong with this cursed thing? Is it broken? Sorry, miss, but we're right. the only students in the magic school can enter here. You want me to become a student, you have to pass the entrance exam. You must be joking. Enough! I am quite certain you're throwing a tantrum will not grant us entry. Yeah, that's a real bummer, alright? Guess it's time to head on home and hit the books, eh? Excuse me. What is it? Would you three mind coming with me for a moment? Uh-oh. And why should we? I merely want to have a quick chat. I believe I may be able to assist you with your problem. Fine then, lead the way, but this better not be a waste of my time. I can promise you, it won't be. He has a face model, he's important. Be on your guard. The last time I was in a situation like this, things went sour quickly. Oh, you back away also made you kill yourself? Good times. Come to think of it, I still haven't heard and paid you back for that, you impudent little... I know what you are. Pardon? I know the two of you are dark mages, and that silver-haired gentleman over there is a demon. I should have known that pitiful disguise wouldn't fool anyone for long. We were in this town for less than five minutes. Are you serious? You blame me for your incompetence? It was obvious your constant blathering that exposed us. On the contrary, his disguise is quite good. Excellent, in fact. Only a demon of considerable power could cast a strong illusion magic. The only reason I recognize him is because I've trained myself to do so. I can spot a demon or dark mage in disguise with only a moment's glance. You're playing a dangerous game, boy. What's to stop us from killing you and tossing your lifeless body into the void? I can get you in the whole million. Explain yourself, human! The magic circle that transports people from Lindale to Luminion only activates when, when whoever steps on it possesses a certain magical mark on their hand. In order to obtain that mark, one must pass the entrance exam, normally at least. Fortunately for you, I discovered a way to imitate the spell that inscribes students with the mark of passage. If I cast it on the three of you, you'll be able to enter freely. And what exactly do you want in exchange? Besides your life, of course. Simple. I want you to take me to the Abyss. What? Say what? The demon's presence here can only be the result of two possibilities. One, he entered through a portal that was opened by Reinhardt the Betrayer over 200 years ago. Or two, you possess the ability to enter and exit the abyss freely. Judging by your previous comment about throwing my lifeless body into the void, I would assume it's the latter. 
cheeky little human. Wait, wait, wait! You want to go into the abyss? The place to all the ravenous, fleshy monsters? Why would you want to do that? Ow! Shut up, you fool! If he's willing to assist us, don't try to talk him out of it. All right, all right, sheesh. So then, do we have an agreement? We do, so long as you can do what you say. Excellent. Everyone, please hold still. That was unpleasant. So much pain. <laughs> Your weak human bodies obviously cannot tolerate pain as well as we demons can. That's one trait about your kind I actually enjoy. I really don't like him. You should be able to pass into Luminion <laughs> freely now. I expect you to hold up your end of the bargain. Of course, I'm a woman of my word, when it suits me. Excellent. Forgive my rudeness, but I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Marcus Schwartzfield. I am Pandora. Over there is my underling, Damien. Underling? The demon who never stops scowling is Azriel. Hmm. Once we've finished our business here, you'll get what you deserve. I'll make sure of that. Excellent. I look forward to it. I'm afraid I must be going. Class should be starting soon. It's been a pleasure doing business with you, Miss Pandora. Oh, it certainly has. I swear to God, this dude fucking betrays us later. I'm going to be so pissed. Well, we can go into the academy now, so let's go. We're going straight there. We don't exactly have encounters to fight. Alright. So this is it. So this is Luminian. Wow. Kind of impressed that they managed to make a flying school. Impressive. The key to accessing Rowan's tower lies somewhere within these walls. Seek it out and find it immediately so you can perceive my plans. Alright, alright, Ragnarok, let's go. So we have to actually do, like, classes and stuff. Oh my, what a beautiful dress! Are you new here? I suppose you could say that, yes. Well, on behalf of all the students here, welcome to Lumillion. I hope we can be friends. Class is about to start, so we'll hurry up. We can talk more at lunch. See you later! Johnny, where did I put that textbook? Where? <laughs> Alright, so where are we supposed to go? The ladies' room. The men's room. There's nothing over here. Um, what's this? Is that true that learning white magic being closer to the meal? How should I know, you simpering child? What? What well, the scary lady meant was to say, of course it will. You just have to believe in yourself. <laughs> Not very good at this whole subtlety thing, are you? Hmm. <laughs> Class 1A, the history of magic. Alright, so what are we supposed to do? Magical constructs. Principles of magehood. Potion crafting. Elements of magic. Okay, yeah, thanks, Ragnarok. Oh, what's this? New students? Please take a seat in the back, which we were just getting started. Now then, class, today's lesson will be on light magic. Before that, may I ask a question? Of course! How does one gain access and in entry into Rowan's Tower? Rowan's Tower is a sacred place where the goddess's arc light is located. This precious stone is guarded by some of the most powerful mages in the Dale. As such, entry is normally prohibited. Only students who have been enhanced with a potential marking from the headmaster himself can get through, through the magically sealed door that protects it. But don't worry, once we take a field trip there, you'll be able to see the majesty of the arc life for yourselves. Wonderful. Now then, let's begin. Light magic spells can range from healing spells to more offensive projectile and enhancement spells. Of all the elemental magics, light is more coveted, not only for its ability to heal, but because of its nature. When one casts a light magic spell, they borrow power from the goddess of light herself, strengthening their bond with her... Unlike dark magic, which draws its power from hatred and malice, light magic grows stronger when the caster's heart is filled with positive emotions, love, courage, and the will to protect others. Oh my god, cry me a fucking river. Unfortunately, it's a difficult power to master if only those with pure hearts can will it to its fullest potential. It is said, however, that when someone truly masters light magic, they will be able to hear Lumiel's voice. We should all aspire to reach such lofty heights. 
Is that the truth? Marcus, do you have something to add? How can you be sure that light magic is the means through which we may contact the goddess, or for that magic, the wanted slaughter of the dark mages? Marcus, if we cannot speak with her, then how can we possibly discern her will? How do we know we haven't simply been stinging our hands with blood in vain? These concepts are simply fabrications born from human insecurities due to the goddess's absence. I am not convinced that these technique teachings are anything more than idle conjecture at best. Perhaps if we were to come to understand dark magic instead of fearing it, we may uncover hidden truths as to the will of the gods. Marcus, I'd like to see you out in the hallway! <laughs> Marcus, we've talked about this. Yes, and I was unsatisfied with the outcome of our last conversation. You know how dangerous it is to ask about dark magic! What are you thinking? You're heading down the same dark path as your father. We both know where that path leads. Father did nothing wrong. All he did was seek knowledge. The scope of that knowledge extended outside the bubble of ignorance those in power would seek to keep the masses trapped inside. That is why they banished him, and you did absolutely nothing to defend him. Marcus, he was researching the abyss. There is no such thing as dabbling in the dark arts. Once they've taken hold of your attention, they slowly pull you in and never let go. That initial, seemingly innocent spark of curiosity eventually grows to an insatiable hunger for power and eventually consumes you. I watched it happen to your father. I won't let it happen to you. And if I should continue to seek the truth, will you turn your back on me as well, mother? Just like you did with father? Marcus! I will not stop trying to learn. I will not willingly close my mind and live in blissful ignorance like the rest of the world. Oh, Marcus, why can't you say I'm only trying to protect you? Hmm, interesting. Oh, hey. That was quite an inspiring little speech you gave back there. You people, what do you want? Thing is, we don't even have to stay on our hands till Mommy Dearest decide to take us on a field trip. We want in now. Seeing as how you were able to get us into the school with a hitch, we figured you could make it happen. Entering the child without proper clearance is against school rules. And seeking three unregistered students to the front gate isn't? Very well, but in exchange, I'd like to interview all of you when this is over. That's just fine. Meet me at Rowan's Tower. I will need to, you'll need to incapacitate the guards. I'll take care of the rest. It'd be my pleasure. Alright, so wait, so where so we go in the Okay. Alright, nice. We actually get to do some fighting. I'm gonna be honest, I've been kind of worried about the lack of action we've gotten lately. So let's go nuke the hell out of some dudes. Alright, so hold on. I am going to assume we're going to be fighting male enemies. So, using land, it's fine. Excuse me, would you mind stepping aside? My associates and I have business in the tower. Entry is prohibited without the headmaster's permission. No one is allowed inside. Oh, what a pity. That was the wrong answer. <laughs> you, you're dark mages! Ooh, nothing gets past you, does it? I apologize for the inconvenience, but I'm afraid we can't let you live. Goodbye. Alright, finally, we get to do some pointing. Um, let's just blow them up. Let's do all the fun stuff. Let's... Let's use String Cutter on one of them. What if... Eyes of Temptation. And we have Asriel now. We have some fun stuff. So let's use... He has a lot of hit alls. So let's use Infernium Ultima. Alright, well, they're fucked now. Oh yeah, they're fucked now. Okay. That's fine. Uh, what should you Shadow Bolt? And then we can use Dread Cannon. You just attack, and then let's use Ashen Flame. Dodge 
Wow, he actually lived. All right, watch this auto. Fight's already over. All right, nice. Damien, level 13, and Azrael in level up. Still breathing, hmm? They're more resilient than I thought. I'll just have to fix that. Stop! Oh, hey. There's no need for bloodshed. Just be on your business. Take care of your business. Be on your way. You dare to command us, you impudent child? No killing or the deal is off. Do I make myself clear? Fine, then. If you're going to put up such a fuss about it. What? Just bear with it for a while. We need this boy for the time being. We may require his assistance later. All right, boy. You have our word. Very good. Now, before I open this gate, I need you to tell me something. Why are you so desperate to enter the tower? Shoot, I was afraid he was going to ask. What should we tell him? We are going to destroy the arc light. You... Why would you tell him that straight up? You crazy? He'll never listen if you tell him that. Have you lost what little sense to possess human? You want the truth? I'll give you the truth. The goddess is not a kind, benevolent angel the world would have you believe she is. In reality, she's nothing but a selfish tyrant seeking to create her ideal world. We dark mages are not part of that world. To her, we are nothing but undesirables to be purged. If she had her way, the world would be made up of her sniveling puppets groveling at her feet. Simply because our souls contain her opposite element, she sees fit to have her dogs hunt us down and slaughter us like animals. I never yield, will never yield to her, nor will I roll over and die. I won't spend my life running and hiding or feeling shame over the very fact that I was born. No, I will strike back with my full fury. If it takes every last breath in my body, I will have the world see her for the monster that she is. That's why I intend to smash that cursed crystal to bits in an act of defiance. To the world is a beacon of comfort, but to us it is a symbol of enslavement. I will show Lumiel and the entire world that the Dark Mage shall not yield, that we shall live on, that we shall be free! Your resolve is admirable. Truly, there's more to Dark Mages than I, ever, than I know. You and I are very much alike. We both seek to break free from the shackles of this world. I'd be honored to assist you in such an endeavor. The gate is open. Do what you came here for. I wish you all good luck. Thank you. You have no idea what this means to us. Yes, thank you so much. You gullible fool. Alright. So here we are. We hereby dedicate this tower her to Rowan, the mage, whose skill and bravery aid in defeating the evil god Ragnarok. May we never forget your brave deeds. Awkward. That miserable mage perished centuries ago, yet I live on. The final victory is mine. Whatever you say, boss. Shut up, demon. <laughs> Alright. One ether. Nice. One ether. And one more ether. Alright, nice. Two ethers. Whoa, what the hell? What the- is this truly the inside of a building? It seems this place was enchanted by a powerful spell. Be on your guard. Whoever is responsible undoubtedly wields formidable power. What in the hell is this? How troublesome. This rock appears to be enchanted. Seems we'll have to find a way to break the spell for him to proceed. Oh, so we got actual puzzles now. Ah, uh, and we need we need a key too. Oh, and there are counters in here. Oh, hi. Earth constructs. Well, how fortunate that we now have a guy. Well, actually, I probably should have swapped out Laneth. Fortunately, we have a guy who literally. Oh boy. Yeah, Lana does no damage. Okay, never mind. There was this fire. Oh my goodness. 
Jesus. See, this is what the problem is with not having access to new equips yet. Shit, I was supposed to swap out Lanneth. Um, well, that's bad. Alright, let's do this. Alright, yeah, we get two attacks. Jesus. Yeah, Lanneth is not going to be useful here. But at least our double attacks are helpful. Jesus. This dude's fucking hurt. I forgot that I'm planning to swap Lanneth out. Alright, let's... I won't have enough for two. Yep, it doesn't work because they are constructs. They are not men. Bruh. Alright. Well, it looks like magic is the only way to go. Physical attacks are worthless. Which means that Damien may actually have more viability here than I thought. Without using Marionette. There, he's dead. We got an enchanted stone. God. Wait, can we... Can we use the thing here? Wait. <laughs> Wait. Hold on. Oh my god, that is so fair and balanced. <laughs> oh, what the hell is this? So you can literally fight the encounter, leave to go heal, and then just come back and you'll be right back where you are. Oh, these fuckers again? Oh my god. Alright, well, we're gonna need to use some of our better stuff. Okay, they resist that too. Alright, yep. It seems that the play is basically just spam our AoEs. And then hopefully that kills them. Because physical attacks aren't working. I have not gotten the 30% at all yet. Yet meanwhile, I can get 30%, get 10% insta kills. I went the wrong way. Damn it. Alright, it doesn't matter. We can look. Oh, these fucking. Earth constructs need to fuck off. Come on. Nope. Damien is pretty fast, though. He's not faster than Lanneth, but he is pretty fast. Okay, yeah, Draconis is probably a bad idea, because they resist fire, so Chimera, go. I know I'm wasting a turn on this, but... Let's just try Snapjaw. Wow. This is a pretty awful time to get Asriel, to be honest. Like, his fire skills are basically his bread and butter, as far as I'm aware. And yet, he can't even use them because... To full effect, because these dudes resist fire. Demon Dark Soul. Alright, well, we actually got a new skill. Our health is fine for now. Let me see what that skill does, so. though. It costs HP, completely restores MP, and has MP cost for five turns, but the user takes damage. So it's basically you're trading. Full MP recovery for HP. Up, oh, okay, we got the first strike. More Earth Constructs, though. We don't need to use that because we literally just leveled up. So let's try Voltic Thunder. Still no 30%. Okay, good. 
Okay, I actually does damage. I do not have enough to use this anymore. Great. Well, that sucks. Uh Let's get a buff up. I am going to start cutting these fights because it's a bit if we're going to be running into the same enemy a thousand times, I'm just gonna start not showing the fights. Speaking of which, we are not getting money from these fights. Plus, oh, there's chest. Speaking of which, I'll be right back. I swear this hit rate for getting the effect off is not 30%. I have seen 30% before, and it's called Scald. Scald has a 30% chance to hit, yet it's not actually 30%. Yet, meanwhile... I have not gotten the thing once. But yeah, being able to warp back whenever I want is very fair balanced. But we got... The Earth Key! So now I gotta go all the way back. So I think after we... I'll be right back. So! I actually got it for once. We got Darkfire Bolt, and Asriel got a level up. But yeah, I actually got the effect. Once! <laughs> off screen, unfortunately, so I didn't get to show it off, because of course not. Oh my god, fuck off. Alright, well, at least we got a new move to. Uh huh. Well, I can't use it right now, so I'll be right back. So, so the dude literally just killed himself, which was pretty funny, but yeah, I can see now why Damien can be good. If you can get that 30% off, Damien does not have to- Oh my god, fuck off. I'll be right back. Okay, as I was saying before I was rudely interrupted, if you can get the 30% off, Damien is not immobilized. Why? Oh my god, are you kidding me? Alright, well, let me, let me see here. Uh. So I, yep, it's a rock pushing. Can I step on this? No. There might not be encounters during this. I screwed up. Does this reset it? Or, nope, that's why I had to get it to. So let's see here. Fortunately, there are encounters in here, but. Alright, hold on. We gotta leave and come back. I think it's this way.
I got it. Okay, I figured it out. Boom. Puzzle master right there, ladies and gentlemen. Who the heck is this? Alright, well, this looks like it's gonna be an encounter. So let's go heal first. Alright, let's go. <laughs> this is so fair and balanced. And then for good measure, let's save the game too. I am the Earth Sage, guardian of the Seal of Earth. You who would enter this place unbidden, state your purpose. I assure you, you're the one keeping that bottle from the seal in place. I'm afraid we're going to have to ask you to take it down. I sense much darkness in your hearts. Minions of the dark, be crushed by the weight of the Earth and crumble! Oh, we have a boss! You are fools to come to this place, evil ones! Alright, the Earth Sage. Let's try out Dark Fire Bolt. We are going to Marionette Chimera. Let's hit him with a Sigil of Weakness at the start, and we can't stop our buff, so let's just attack him. Well, we didn't get a burn or dark. Dark resistance down. I missed. Quake! Oh my god, I'm so glad you said a weakness at the start there. Um. Let's just use Infernal Awakening on Chimera. Try and. Let's buff up Azriel and then attack. Twice. Nice. Nice. Okay, that's Spire Wall. Oh, that's a defense buff. Okay, that sucks. Hmm, him with another Dark Fire Bolt. I have no way of getting rid of that, so we're just gonna have to Ash and Flame. And then I'll try and poison him. Twice. No burn. No damage. We poison him though, so he's now on a timer. Earth Storm. How? I mean, I can heal if I need to. So let's hit him with another Dark Fire Bolts. Let's use Infernium Ultima. And then Chimera, hit him once, and Voltic Thunder. He should be dead soon. Our Marionette's gonna run out soon. Bruh, stop. I am so glad I decided to go heal. Okay, that does nothing. Yep, alright. So, Damien's back in the fight. Let's heal. Let's use a Dread Cannon. Uh. Wait, are your debuffs gone? No, they're still up. Let's use it again, though. Because I don't know if debuffs stack. And then he's already poisoned, so let's just hit him. Dodge this. Okay, he's dead. Fight's over. There we go! Fuck you, Earth Sage. Got a rune stone. We actually got money. Your actions shall invite ruin upon us all. The Earth Seal has been broken. Invite ruin, you say? Sounds delightful. Alright, well, he's down. Let's go. I mean, it's a real shame that I really can't take advantage of Lanneth in these situations, but... Alright, the wall is down. Don't tell me there's another one. Oh, there's a cutscene. Oh, Marcus. Why would you believe me? What can I say to convince you? Am I going to be forced to simply sit and watch as someone I love slips away from me again? Am I powerless to do anything at all? Miss Schwarzfield. Oh, it's the Headmaster. I'm assuming it's the Headmaster. Oh, Headmaster Muldron! 
What seems to be troubling you, my dear? Is it the boy? I just don't know what to say to him anymore. He's dead set on learning about dark magic, no matter the consequences. He's holding a grudge against me for what I did to Darren. I know it. I don't think he'll ever forgive me. Did I? Did I really do the right thing? Banishing Darren was hard for all of us. It was the most difficult thing I have ever done had to do in my life. But it had to be done. We had to protect the nail. There are things in this world that are bigger than us, my dear. Sometimes we will sacrifice our own personal feelings for the greater good. No matter how much it pains us, we must always do what is right. Yes, you're right. Thank you. Classes are done for the day. Why don't you take a visit to Rowan's Tower and meditate for a while? It has a way of calming the soul and clearing the mind. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> are we going to have to fight her? Here, I'll give you my box so you can enter. Thank you, Headmaster. You always seem to know what to say to make me feel better. One of the few perks of getting old, my dear. We geese have been running our mouths for so long, we've practically made it to an art form. Oh, ho, ho. oh boy. Well, I guess there's- Oh, come on! Are you serious? There's another one of these. Phew, breezy. Bet you're glad we decided to wear a dress instead of a skirt, huh? <laughs> kidding! I was just kidding! Next time you make a remark like that, I will personally remove your tongue. Yeesh, no sense of humor at all. Well then, this is a problem. Guess we're gonna have to murder another guy. So, uh, alright, yeah, we can't kill him, never mind. So next time, guess we're gonna be fighting more constructs and going through this mess. So I'm going to assume there's a fire and water seal, too. God damn it, this tower, though. Anyway, next time. We're gonna go beat up some more sages. I'll see you then.